What's up guys? So I just got my exhaust done. Um, full length headers, Mopar. It was a, a new old stock that I picked up on eBay from the factory and um, got a steal on it. 600 bucks, it's full length headers with high flow cats and everything. Really nice piece. Then I went to a custom exhaust place. I had them do a three inch cat bat uh, dual flow master 40s on it. Um, didn't do any any fancy tips. I just have those stock black tips, which I kind of like. Uh, just gives it like an old badass look. I turned the wheel a little bit so I can try and show you the headers. So you can see the headers sticking down. Let's see if we can get in there and see them. Uh, see those bad boys? So, I think you were able to see them. Sorry, I'm not a professional. I don't have a, a camera that can really sneak inside there. But uh, they look really good, sounds really good. So I'm gonna start up the car. I can tell you right off the bat, um, big difference. I really, just what I thought, this 5.7 liter motor is really choked up, you know. The 6.4 liter comes with those really nice um, Mopar shorty type headers from the factory. Those exhausts flow really nice. So those come right out of the factory with some really nice uh, output. Whereas this 5.7 liter has always been choked up. Um, just following along with the Ram guys, a lot of the Ram guys seem to uh, be pioneering what um, works on the 5.7 liters. And a lot of what I'm gonna be doing is I'm, I'm kind of taking their lead a little bit. So I'm gonna start the car. I'm gonna have to go old school. I don't have a remote start. My wife says I don't need one. She says I don't need to be like, you know, the cool kids. We live in Florida, so I don't have to use the excuse of warming my car up and all that bullshit. I just I want to be like the cool kids. Um, I'll probably get one in the future anyway. Just don't tell Kate. So I'll start it up right away. Just give me a second to put the phone down. Ugh. Okay, so I hope you guys got a good sound of it. Um, I've always been a Flowmaster fan. Growing up on Fox Body Mustangs, that was like the thing to have back then is Flowmaster mufflers. That sound coming from the Flowmasters, it was like the only thing to get back then. So I stuck with the Flowmasters. I like them on this car just as much as I liked them on the older Mustangs. Um, they are pretty loud, I can tell you that. When you're cruising in your car and you're doing uh, shit when i get up to about two grand rpm that's when the drone really hits in you know obviously we took the resonators out um so yeah about about 2000 rpm or so there's a little bit of drone but it goes away as soon as you start accelerating or slow down a little bit whatever you don't you're not going to sit at two grand forever so i just deal with the drone plus i kind of like it because it's it's pretty aggressive and my wife hates it so she drives the car even less now which I'm happy about. Um, but that's it, you know. I hope you enjoyed the video. Flowmaster 3 inch cat back, full length Mopar headers. Uh, what's next on the horizon? Probably, I think, well, I already ordered a catch can. So I'm also gonna do um, some either MSD coil packs or Salt and Spark. I heard really good things about those. I know a lot of people don't believe in them. But everything that I've seen on them, they work, and they work well. And I know my experience in the past with MSD coils have, has always been a good experience. So I don't give a shit what anybody says. I don't care what anybody wants to balk at. I don't care. I'm, I'm going to get them. I'm going to put them in there. My whole point to this car is to really try and wring every little bit of horsepower, usable power I can get out of this 5.7 before I start to dig into the heads and the cam and the intake. Because I, I will end up doing that eventually. I'll probably buy some Nissan or an Infiniti or something to drive to work every day and eventually this will just be a fun car. 
Um, got some, let's see, bear brakes, six piston brake calibers over the horizon, not too far away. Um, but yeah, I plan on having a lot of fun with this car. This, this is going to be the, uh, I, I'm really going to try and get some Hellcat performance out of it. Maybe not 700 horsepower, but shit, with a 150 direct port of nitrous, I should be able to get up in the 600 areas by the time I'm done. So I hope you guys stay tuned. I hope you guys are interested in it. I hope, uh, these cars are, are going pretty cheap now. You can get regular RTs now. I'm seeing them for five and six grand with these five, seven liters. And I just think that uh, a lot of people are going to start picking these up and you can go pretty fast, pretty cheap. So hope you guys like the videos. I hope I help a lot of people out and keep watching. Hit that subscribe button. Thanks.